Okay, come on. Wake up. Wake up. This is amazing. I can't believe it. So this is it people, one of the most important items that I'm going to review for this year. As the word says it all, yes, it is the full kit for Clickbot kindly sent by Kei Tech. So thank you very much Kei Tech for this. So this defines what my channel is about, which is robotics. This is my biggest passion that I want to continue on for years to come for my channel because I know a lot of viewers come to my channel watching robots and etc. So I want to make sure my viewers get satisfied on that subject. Um, and this is going to be the new era for my channel because this is going to explore with infinite opportunity with fantastic product like this enough said let's get into the unboxing so here it goes okay so let's see what is inside oh well done okay this side as well so what we have here people is the click ball right okay so that's quite heavy isn't it here it is Really nice packaging. All right, so let's take the cover out. We got the nice um, sticker. Very cute. So we could peel off individual one of them, probably but attach it on the click ball. Now we got the number one here and um, number two. Okay, finally we got the number two out. So let's see what's inside number one, shall we? So, <laughs> oh, look at that. We got another sort of warranty card here and another sort of instruction manual uh, booklet here. And we've got accessories here as well. So um, let's look at what sort of accessories we got. All oh, right, so that's the USB-C cable there to charge the click ball. Wow, okay, so these are, I think, part of the joints. Right, so this kind of looks like a sticker-ish kind of thing at the moment, but We'll come back to that. So I believe this is the brain ASMR. We got the main head. Um, so this I presume is the wheel. Really good quality plastic I have to say. This is really high tech. Um, so we got the single and the three joint. That's another sort of mid joint I would say. And um, that's another, oh, this looks like a camera mount. You know what? That's going to be very interesting. I could almost mount this camera of my own to this one, I think. And um, probably this is a suction or a feet. All right, so let's look at box number two. It's slightly bigger than box number one, by the way. Wow. So we got another wheel there. <laughs> that's cool. Um, that is amazing we got a hand here so we could actually pick things up i believe this is like a feet cat feet i would say so we've got two joints we saw three joints early on two of them with two joints and we got another sort of um is there like a limb who knows but um all right so this is the suction one oh gosh do you see that so that's the suction leg, two of them. So this is why it's called full kit. This is amazing. Like how many stuff can you do with these sort of things? It's just unlimited, isn't it? But this is all, this all seems to have this unified joint of this, which is very interesting. Yeah, so that's all for the box two, which continues on with the box one. So before we get into all the details of assembly, I just want to highlight this head or the brain. So it seems to have this camera, a lot of actually fancy stuff in the main screen. And on the back side, we got these joint components, but most importantly, we got the on and off button and also the uh, USB-C, that's where you charge it. So I presume this will be the power source for the rest of the components. The moment of truth, let's actually turn on the Click ball. So it's starting click ball. Hello. Okay, so English. 
and download Clickbulk app, which I will. All right, so you get a QR code here. So I need to scan the QR code through the robot. Okay, so make sure. Okay, I think it's doing it. Yeah, so the actual app is saying that the Clickbulk is updating. So please stand by and see how it goes. All right, so it says active Clickbulk now. So do I press here? Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> cool, look at that. Clickbook has been activated. I can see something is happening. It's showing this like a animation showing the story background of how uh, Clickbook came about actually. So I hope we're in the right journey here. It sounds like we are, which is really exciting. <laughs> That's cool. So you would have noticed from my previous clip, um, it wasn't assembled properly. So Clickbox software is telling me that I should add another extra joint in here. And this is really clever. Okay. This is so cool. Hello. <laughs> this is amazing. Wow, just the movement wise. So actually it's on the app. It says I'm um, asking for basic skill roulette. Hello, hello. <laughs> okay, so if I, if I touch the back, it seems to be reacting to it. That's really clever. How do they do that? Is there a sensor on the back? Wow, knock his head so Hey, so it's getting annoyed. So, <laughs> so it's not liking it. Okay, so pat the back of the head to awake him. Okay, come on, wake up. Wake up. This is amazing. I can't believe it. It's like, wow, okay. So there are basic overview uh, skills of eight of them that I, sh I could try out for this configuration. So I guess this is one of the most um, standard version that we should try out. Can I poke the eye? Let's try to poke the eye. Poke the eye. Poke the eye. <laughs> it's getting annoyed. Sorry. Okay, so there's a lot of skills that actually I could try out. That's really interesting. That is so cool. I can't believe it. It's just mankind actually come up with such technology. It's just brilliant. There seems to be quite a lot of sensors onto this robot, which is amazing. Anyhow, let's go on for the other figures, shall we? So the plus and minus, always keep that. And then also do the same to the other side as well. And then I think we need to attach the head. Now uh, let's turn on the robot. That's just amazing. See, that's another thing. So this actually has an automated. Oh, don't don't go. You're actually on the top of the table. But this actually has a self balancing sensor as well. And um, it's just amazing how it can move. Wow. OK, don't get too wild. Otherwise, you're going to fall off the table. No, so you don't like that. Anyhow, that's pretty much it. As you go to the app, there's menus actually. So on the top left, there's a playground, academy, community, uh, challenges and workshop. But when you go to the playground, you get all these sort of like animations of what has been pre-designed. And I actually managed to find something that was quite cool, um, which was the um, robot that shape is like what I have here. And this is purely based on this one. And what has actually happened is if I press the play, you got to make sure you assemble it all correctly, by the way. Um, and if, if you do, um, you will actually get this control settings here, which is amazing because it's all pre-programmed. So if I press forward, let's actually press backwards actually. So if I press backwards, it will actually go backwards, turn left, So that's actually how it's programmed. And um, if you actually press this one, 
it's actually doing a bit of a gesture there. So let's actually show you what's happening here, by the way. So these are all pre-programmed. And that's amazing. So people came up with all this sort of like coding and the community has a really strong community wise. So that's why you, we actually managed to get this sort of pre-assembly program system. And it's amazing that you actually go through this. But if we actually go back to the actual app, so that's how you can play around with the playground. But if you go to the academy, there's some of the things that you can actually learn um, and watch the videos and so on, which is very useful. Um, and also if you go to the community, which is what which I find very interesting is that uh, some people actually came up with brilliant ideas. So you can actually download some of the codes and then apply it uh, to your own style as well. So they got a really strong community as well. That's amazing. So I really look forward to explore that. So this all this endless sort of um, community build design. That's something I was thinking about, a scorpion kind of dog wheel kind of thing, which is quite cool. So you can actually download those sort of applications. Um, challenges, so you could actually go for the weekly challenge and then you can win a prize as well. So you've got this really healthy, um, happy community out there that you can have so much fun with. This is really amazing. So it's like a um, another sort of like internet society, isn't it? And then if we go to the workshop, this is some sort of like a discussion forum that you could actually post questions or have discussion with people. So it's like another internet system, isn't it? So it's amazing. So this is Clickbog, everyone. So I really enjoyed it. I cannot believe already uh, four or five hours actually have been passed by since I've been playing around with it. Now the material itself, you know when you actually grip on it, it is a really premium quality. And uh, you realize even though you, you can drop it sometimes it's going to endure for a very long time and I just love the fact that it has this sort of LED edging on it and light bulbs and also the screen itself it looks so like so cool cyborg kind of like feel and so on and um, I know that there's going to be a lot of updates that you, I, I'll be able to tell you guys in the future as well but overall um, I was amazed how you how you can explore with the playground. It actually gives you this three dimensional sort of thing where if you actually haven't assembled it properly, it will remind you which part. Uh, so you can rotate the 3D uh, mapping of the robot as well. But not only that, you can actually learn from Academy and also share with the community and get information from the community as well, challenges and workshop and so on. But I also found out that there's the Go Creative side on as well, which I will be able to come up with some new ideas and then post it onto the uh, community side and also share with you guys as well. So what I'm trying to do for my next video, um, I hope it's gonna be more than one or two after this is that when I come up with some clever design or when I actually find something very clever that will be very practical uh, for our daily use, I'll actually definitely uh, make another video, share it with you guys. But overall, I hope this video gave you a really good first glimpse of what this clickbox is about. But if you have any queries, please do comment below. And overall, I really, really enjoyed it. And Second of all, I'm really excited to make further videos and play around with this brilliant, brilliant invention robot device called ClickBot. So thank you very much for watching this video. If you have any queries, please do comment below. I'll be more than happy to come back to you. All the best. Bye-bye.